So welcome back to the Simply Central Show. I invite you to like, share, follow at Simply Central on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. And don't forget to check out the footage on YouTube, the Simply Central channel. So you saw all of the things that have happened over the last nine months, right? The radio show, the Question of Faith premiere, we went to the mayor's office, NAACP events, and there have been other things that have happened since then. So I've had the opportunity also to meet Dr. Bill Picard, billionaire in the automotive industry, as well as be in the presence of Dr. Freddie Haynes of Friendship West Baptist Church in Dallas and also Bishop Dixon here in Houston. We have done a lot of great things. And let me tell you that all of this still requires more preparation. I am still uncomfortable. So every time there's more opportunity, there's more more things that I'm able to do, I've got to now go back and look at this footage. I have to look and see what it is I did well and what things I can improve on. So remember to inspect what you expect. So you know you go in, you're putting your best foot forward, you're taking the step, you're taking action, and now you have to tweak so you can be a little bit better. So I'm also still getting invites to do a number of other things. My circle has elevated. We've talked a lot about changing your circle and your company so that you can move towards the things you want to do. Well, there are a number of people that are influential and they are operating in circles that I would like the opportunity to share the vision of from the ground up, build a better, building a better you. And so I'm getting these invites and now I need to prepare for that next level. So I want you to take a look at what I was invited to do next. Now this has been the pinnacle. K-H-O-U stands for Houston on the heels of what has happened in Charlottesville, Virginia. Those protests, some of the horrific messages and things that happened there and KHOU, Bishop Dixon, and the community has come out to now start the conversation. I was invited to do some interviews from the green room all the way to the news station studio. Take a look at some of the things that happened there. Thank you for joining us tonight for what is sure to be a difficult but necessary conversation about race. Hello, I'm Lynn Cannon. And I'm Mia Gradney. We want to welcome everyone watching, not just on air, but also our live stream on the KHOU Facebook page, app, web page, and YouTube. Yeah, we have a prominent group for you tonight to help in our discussion, including city leaders, community activists, and law enforcement. <laughs> All right? Okay. There'll be no trick oh, yeah. questions. Hi, hey, Central Reed, hey, nice to meet you. How are you? Good I'm to wonderful. see you. It's a yes. pleasure. Yes, are you going to be in here with us? Hi. Uh, no, I'm going into the uh, studio here in a minute. Okay. Yeah. Right. Well, then pleasure. I, I guess I'll handle this one. Then. Okay. You, no, you got it. All right, now. It's on you. That's what I do. All right. Okay. <laughs> Hi, we meet. I'm sorry. Yes, the we do. was there. I didn't want her to get no, out of the No, 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 no worries. No worries. All right, wonderful. Simply Central here with Miss Mia. Thank you so much for taking the time to have a quick conversation. Sure. You were our you were out there with the audience today. You were asking questions about the unity. We're talking about stands for Houston and on the hill, the heels of everything going on in Charlottesville, Virginia. What is Houston poised to do? Simply Central here with the Lynn, and we have had you as a wonderful moderator <laughs> tonight. You. We thank you, KHOU, for having this community meeting. Our pleasure. We have Bishop Dixon here, and he's been an activist, and it was wonderful to bring bring him on and have the conversation with all of the panelists. Yeah. Where do you think we go here? Because Houston does get a lot of things right. It is time for some solution. What's the next step? I think this whole event was triggered by what happened in Charlottesville. Yes. But I was just telling somebody we don't have to wait on an event. Uh, oh, okay. Yes, just a couple of questions. Yes. 
Hi, Simply Central here, and we are here with Bishop Dixon and also with Sally from KHOU, and we appreciate the forum, we appreciate the support to get the conversation started. What do you think we accomplished tonight? You know, I think it was a great opportunity for people to really hear from each other. A lot of the times we, we see each other on the streets, we walk by, but we this was an opportunity for people of different races and religions to come together and hear their neighbor talk about what's really going on in our community. And one gentleman who, I think it was a young gentleman who talked about, you know, it's out there, but we're not talking about it. Yeah. So we hope that at least have started the conversation and we hope it'll continue. I think that's great. What do you what do you feel KHOU or would would you like to pledge KHOU to do in collaboration with Bishop Dixon, the community of faith, and also the citizens of Houston to continue to move the conversation forward? Well, we love working with Bishop Dixon. This isn't the first time we've joined together to um, try and make our community a better place. Mm -hmm. And you know, at KHOU 11 News, we believe in standing for Houston. I mean, KHOU stands for Houston, mm -hmm. and so um, what we hope to do is continue more of these and we talked about already not being reactive to events yes. but being proactive and perhaps getting ahead of the uh, conversations mm -hmm. so that when something happens across the country you know here in Houston we have a better understanding we have a better tolerance we know and can show the rest of the country what it's really like to have a conversation to have differing opinions but be respectful of each other's opinions I love that Bishop why the collaboration with KHOU and Community of Faith like spirits, it's, it's, a, it's more than the community of faith church, it's about the community at large yes. and uh, understanding that it takes all of us doing what all of us can do to make, I say, all of what it can be. And occasionally you get that, thank you, Sally, her team, for just Stella, and uh, working with them has been remarkable. Uh, but I, I think that we did start an important dialogue tonight. Yes. I think people now are ready to move forward and we've got a city who wants to be a model city for the nation and for the world. And I think it has started right here tonight. Wonderful. Thank you, Bishop Dixon. Thank you, Sally. Thank you, KHOU. We really appreciate all that you're doing to bring us all together. So as you can see, this has been an amazing journey and we're just getting started. I had the opportunity to spend time with the KHOU news family, Mia Gradney, Lynn Cannon, Sally Ramirez, the executive news director, Bishop Dixon, Dr. Virgil Woods. You see so many prominent figures, Dr. James Douglas, and all of the wonderful folks that participated in that conversation. The chief of police, Art Acevedo, and our sheriff, Ed Gonzalez. We also had Stephen Kleinfeld there and a number of other panel members, including Mary Ramos of LULAC. So the conversation and the influence in that room to bring about change was amazing. I had to prepare myself for that opportunity. Those individuals are now a part of the people that I can draw from to share with you the message of from the ground up, building a better you. There's no telling where this platform can go. There's no telling what we can bring to you. So I encourage you today to start where you are. Start where you are with what you have. All of the teachings come from your experience. You have to be out there to experience something and you have to be okay with being uncomfortable. I am uncomfortable every day. I have said it in the shows you've seen it as recently as the last show i have to prepare for those things and be ready for the things that are coming up i'm so excited for the journey i look forward to continuing to share it with you as well as showing you all the different things we're doing with the platform all the wonderful guests that we're bringing on and watching you create your vision that's what we're here for we want you to start from where you are and get to where you want to be Take it from me, this is everyone's journey. No one starts at the top. And when you do start, it's work. Be willing to put in the work, the reward is gonna be great. Again, thank you for joining the Simply Central Show. Like, share, follow at Simply Central on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Check out our YouTube channel, the Simply Central YouTube channel for all of this content and more. See you next time.